Today, we take a look at reclaimed land from the ocean. And yes, it's here in Africa, Nigeria to be precise. The Eco Atlantic City is a unique new coastal city within a city, being built on a vast area of land reclaimed from the Atlantic Ocean along the coast of Victoria Island, Lagos State. Dubbed Nigeria's international commerce city, this city is poised to be the future financial capital of not only Nigeria, but Africa at large. The city adjoins Victoria Island District of Lagos State and the Phase 1 area of Lekki to the north, while the entire western, eastern and southern borders is a coastline. The city has a total of 10 districts spread across a land area of approximately 10 square kilometers, hoping to satisfy needs for financial, commercial, residential and tourist accommodations. It all began in 2006, when South Energy Nigeria Limited was granted permission to build a preliminary seawall to protect Victoria Island from flooding and coastal erosion. As of May 2009, while the project was still in its dredging phase, about 3 million cubic meters have been sandfilled and placed in the reclamation area, while about 35,000 tons of rock have been delivered to the site. In certain parts of Barbage, the land being reclaimed can already be seen. Dredgers are walking around the clock to fill the site with sand. On the 21st of February 2013, a dedication ceremony was held at the reclaimed land of the Echo Atlantic with Good Luck Jonathan, Bill Clinton, Babatunde Fashola, Bola Tinubu, Aminu Tambua, and Ibekule Amosun in attendance. In March 2014, David Frame, Managing Director of South Energy Nigeria Limited, the firm responsible for the development, confirmed that the first residential tower will open in 2016. By November 2020, a few buildings, most notably Eco Pell Towers, have been completed, with several more under construction and are planning stages. The city has become an avenue for popular Afro concerts and sports events like the Lagos City Marathon and Copa Lagos. Just recently, the United States Department of State awarded Phoenix Federal a $319 million US dollar design build contract for the new US consulate in Lagos. According to the statement, the 12.2-acre site for the new Consulate General is part of the Eco Atlantic. The statement further revealed that the architects behind the new building will be Ernard Architects of New York, and the building is expected to be completed by 2027. Similarly, real estate firm Perwinkle Condos acquired 2,400 square meters of land to build luxury condos targeted at high net worth individuals and the diaspora. With the amount of work ongoing at the site, there is no doubt that the Eco-Atlantic City, when completed, will rub shoulders with its counterpart, such as the Champs-Élysées in France and others. Welcome to a world of possibilities.